Bonjour! Welcome to Native High School's edition of The World Speaks French. Today's program includes important updates about French and what it can do for you. French puts the world in world languages. I'm excited about today's focus, Cultivant les Francais, continuant à l'université. I am too, Jasmine. Today we'll answer the question, what is what is the value of continuing to study French in college? We're bringing you all the news to make your lives more successful. Speaking of successful, today international reporter Max will be chatting with our business reporter Brad. Thank you for joining us, Max. What would you like our audience to know about continuing French? My pleasure, Brad. More than ever, today's employers and businesses are seeking people who are fluent in more than English. Really? But I thought all employers are looking for is Spanish, right? <laughs> Brad, Spanish is important in our hemisphere, but in Europe and Africa, it is a key language. By the way, how come my moisturizer and hair mousse have French and English on it? <laughs> Great question, Brad. Our neighbor to the north, Canada, is an officially a bilingual country and the U.S.'s number one trading partner. Cowabunga! I did not know that. Uh, thanks, Max and Brad. Now, from a word from our sponsor, uh, Henri's Emporium of International Opportunity. We've got jobs, jobs, and more jobs. If you have a double major which includes French, hurry on down to Henri's Emporium of International Opportunities. We want you. Nous avons besoin de vous. <laughs> Those two are really something. Yes, they certainly are. Let's check in with our reporters on location in the business district. Thanks, Jasmine and Gianna. I'm talking today with Sebastian and Leah. Tell me, how has French helped with your careers? Well, I took French for four years in high school, but then I stopped. And now I'm having trouble getting transferred to the international division of the company I work for. If I had to do it over again, I would definitely continue in French in college. I'm having trouble moving forward as international man of mystery for the CIA. Sorry to hear about your struggles, Sebastian and Leah. Now we join Emily at a panel discussion in Washington, D.C. Thank you, Anna. I'm here today talking with international executive Derek, world traveler Veronica, diplomat Emily, and volunteer Lizzie. Can you tell us how continuing in French in college has impacted your lives? Being fluent in French thanks to my high school and college French classes has helped me climb to, from Chicago, Illinois to Paris, France, where I am a top executive in the French branch of Coca-Cola International. As I have traveled throughout the world, knowing French has opened many doors for me, as I cannot expect people to automatically speak English. Because of my French, I have made friends in the Swiss Alps, at the Casino in Monte Carlo. I have stayed at Hudson, Senegal, and shopped in the market in Morocco. The world really does speak French. I was chosen for the Peace Corps because I speak French after double majoring in college in French and political science and now I've just been hired by the State Department because of my experience. I have been able to use my language skills to move into the intelligence branch of the military. Next stop for me is Strasbourg, France, working for the United Nations Council of Europe. Cultivant le Francais. Continuant à l'université. Tune in next week when our topic will be the passé complice. Can't we put this behind us? <laughs>